all right we got a new secret so go ahead and smash the like button subscribe turn on notifications all that good stuff and let's take a look at what he does and we'll take a look at his banner but first um now let's just get into this information i was thinking about looking at the rest of the update but let's see how bad the banner is <laughs> well blue infinity merlin is back which is funny so she might be the second best character on this banner i feel like brunhild as much as she's on banners at least she's usable in like pve and stuff so i i'll give her that this <laughs> I, I i i can't i can't cope this is horrible <laughs> <laughs> Yikers. Um, and then at 600, you can pick him. I think I'm at 66 of them just because I took a preliminary look at him and he is a human buff. Uh, but let's take a look at what his ultimate looks like. Why? Why are you showing me Black Ops, bro? Okay, his art looks good. He is, like, very handsome. I ain't gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, let's close Nagato. Uh, but then let's take a look at his information real quick. So the ban is atrocious. Oh, this update was that? That's look kind of weird. So let's zoom in. Why is it all black? I don't know. <laughs> For each specific ally participating in battle, the base stats of all allies are increased by 5%. Damage dealt increases by 10%, and you are given the additional demon trial. So you get 15% basic stats and 30% damage total. That's pretty good. Off to a good start. Uh, and you are given additional demon. Well, I just read that. Also, at the end of the at the end of the turn, all stories. There's no way this is right. There's no way. Please don't prop up in anything inappropriate. Oh, I beat it. Okay. W. Let's take a look at this. Take a look at this because my translations are looking a little bit of wonky. So 5%, 10% damage dealt, Demon Trap, in addition, at the end of the enemy's turn, all enemies are given the Curse of Graham. Curse of what? Curse of Graham for four turns. If you are in a sub slot at the start of the ally's turn, after joining the battlefield, all Graham curses on all enemies are removed once only. And for each Graham curse removed, the enemy's remaining HP is reduced by 15%. So it stacks? Four turns make it makes me think it stacks. That's good to anybody except for Escador. So if you fight enemy Escador teams, that does nothing to him. Other than like providing weak point, I guess. Unless it's a gray uh, debuff, but we're going to see. Um, remaining HP by 50%. And your attack related abilities are increased by 15% up to a maximum of 45%. That could be good. He's a, he sounds like a pretty good backline. Just like if somebody dies, he comes out and he can be decent. I have to see what his skills are first. But certain allies are humans and demons. And Graham Curse's HP related abilities minus 10% can be stacked up three times. So if it's nine on the field. Well, he can only get up to 45%, so it's not like it's limitless. But, uh, okay. 30% minus, or minus 30% in HP-related abilities. If you can get to that third one, that, that sounds pretty good. Let's move on. I'm going to tell you right now, this sounds fine, but, like, this ain't doing nothing to Melum. <laughs> Melum is practically immortal. This is just, like, okay. We went from, like, legendary status to just, like, okay. Like, oh, all right, good. Millen was like a 10 out of 10, and this guy is probably like, sounds so far to be like a 7 out of 10. Good, but not like, oh, you know? Let me see what his skills are. 500% um, piercing damage to single enemy. And then dark onslaught, 450% dark damage to single enemy. Dark damage is increased damage dealt by 1.2% for every 1% of a okay, flood. Um, increased critical chance when using a skill by 50% for each gram curse on all enemies. But that's kind of stupid. If he comes out, takes all of them away. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm, you know what I'm guessing? They kill somebody, Seeger comes out, takes all of the ground curses away, and then my turn starts, and he applies another ground curse, right? So they have like no defense. I mean, not no defense, no HP related. We have 45% attack related. 
And he got all this damage dealt too with the basic stats. I don't know if it's going to be enough, but 50% crit for each gram curse on all enemies. So that's three. That's no limit. Ooh, that sounds pretty good. That sounds like a pretty good skill. 150% crit chance. He going to crit with this. <laughs> hold on hold on you might be cooking um the pierce i could live without it could have gave him a drain and i, I would have been happy like literally like just give me a drain i feel like that's what the human team needs anyway uh but yeah he looked pretty good and then his ultimate same secret ultimate deals 840 percent rush damage to a single enemy uh it was just what it's flood it's basically flood um, he seems like a single target god. He kind of looks like you know from Black Clover with, with with this like picture exactly, but just like he just like grew up a, a tad bit. But hey, hey, okay, don't quote me on that. But um, that's pretty much it on his information. If I had to rate him one to ten, I'd give him a uh, I mean, it's, it's gonna be rough. Him being green and all. They did make him a backline, which is pretty nice. Because if he was just supposed to be on the field, I, I would instantly give him like a zero out of 10. But the fact that he can be ran as a backline and he's affected the fight, lower in their HP related. Not HP related, it's um. Yeah, lower in HP related. I, yeah, yeah, that's, yeah. Human and demon buff, so W. I mean, if I had to rate him, one through 10, I'll give him a, just off his information, not knowing what the stats is, I'll give him a seven. Seven, 7.5 7 out of 10. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If he, if he was just like on field unit, he'd be a zero, but I like him. He's, he's pretty, he sounds to be pretty good. And his single target looks like it's gonna crit too, even though I'm pretty sure his sub stats are like subpar. Um, but let's go for the rest of the update. Um, packs, 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 packs. Don't give this game your money. Uh, we got this thingy. Um, more, well, like, um, oh, just materials and stuff. Four Ogres, Battle Event, yada, yada, yada. Improvements and purchasing, nice tournament, yada, yada, yada. Facial expression for Fairy King. What about a uh, Rumuru? Wait, no, no, no. Somebody told me somebody had a black face or something like that. Who was it? Evade effects was not applied to middle. I'm fixing an issue where with bulk skip. Fix an issue where battle graphics were not applied properly in chapter six. Fix an issue where the facial expression would not change for characters information screen. Fairy King. I think Yalta told me it was Rumuru who had like a a, bl a black like face like he didn't have a face at all it was just black um but i guess they didn't fix that so <laughs> that is all seager looks to be pretty good let me know what you guys think in the comment section below uh thank you for watching if you made it to the end high five your mother i guess sure or if 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 you don't have your mother in your life high five your 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 your, your most love close family member or something like that There's somebody who you can who you live with in the same proximity go high five them please for Davo. just just do it please <laughs> peace out y'all stay good and i'll see you on the next one man